Okay, so I do alarm and remote start installs, you know, and I try to help people out, do, do them if they're not near me. I got a buddy from the military that uh, he's trying to do a remote, uh, actually uh, an alarm system on his 97 Jeep Wrangler. Um, and I'm going to show how it is that I wire, or how you're supposed to wire the starter disabled, starter kill, right? Now, this is just for reference. Um, I'm not liable for if you guys do this, everybody does this and it messes up their vehicle. That's not my responsibility. I'm not liable for it. Uh, just a disclaimer, you know, cover my butt. All right. So, let's say that this is the relay that comes from the alarm. Right, it comes with the alarm system, right? So it would have like an orange wire from the alarm system, right? It's gonna have like a purple pink wire. I believe it's purple, I believe it might be pink. I'm not sure. But um uh this could have been any color really. You know, it could have been red. This is the one on this side, which is pin 86. This goes to 12 volt ignition 12 volt, right? So this would tie into your ignition system into the wires of the alarm that go to the ignition system, right? This one ties into that. Then this one, this orange wire, would tie in, that's what ties into the alarm, right? On the alarm uh, sub-harness, you know, it's gonna have an orange wire, these two wires, those two wires gotta get connected to this, right? That wire, the orange wire go to this, right? And then, on, for the starter, um, this is specifically for the 97 Jeep Wrangler, right? There's a yellow wire at the ignition switch for the Jeep, right? And that's what this wire is representing, right? And what you're going to do is this yellow wire right now is coming from the ignition, right? So it's going from the ignition wire to the fuse box and then from there it goes to the starter, right? So what you want to do is take that wire, right, and you want to cut it. You can cut like that, right? The other half of that wire, the part going to the starter, towards the starter side, would go hooked up to pin 30, which is right here in front, right? Now this wire goes to the starter side of the ignition wire, of the starter cable coming from the ignition key or whatever and then this one here would go to the other side of that wire you cut this would go towards the ignition side so again 87A goes to the ignition side and 30 goes to the starter side 86 goes to ignition 12 volts and 85 would go to the alarm uh, orange wire. Alright, so I hope this helps. Have any questions or comments, leave them in the down below and uh, I'll get back to them. Alright, thanks.